Hey, what's going on, my gilded brethren? Today I'm bringing you another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. It's it's something I was um, you know, I was in the car talking to myself, talking about what I was gonna do, and I thought about split screen, how to create split screen in um in a Premiere Pro, and I figured it out while I was driving home from my grandma's house because I had to spend the day with them because I really enjoy spending time with my grandparents. Nah, nah, I'm just kidding. Go ahead. Let me show you all this this split screen effect that I uh, I freestyle. I freestyled it before I even looked it up anywhere else. I, you know, I did what I thought was the best way to achieve this effect and it looks, looks pretty sweet to me. Check this out. Check this out. Two player wow mode. Yes, I play WoW. You can come join me if you want. I'm a tank. I'm a tank in WoW. I'm a god tank. I'm revered throughout every server. Just look me up. Look up Gildanus. But hey, this is the split screen mode. And I also have the four player Nintendo 64 mode. Watch this. Check that out. Whoa. Four player WoW. We're all using the same keyboard. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But hey, yeah, this is the effect I'm bringing you all today. It's a pretty simple effect. You know, if you if you can utilize it, I I actually will be using the split screen effect for some other other projects I'm working on. But I had to bring it to you all. I had to bring it to the channel, my gilded brethren. Now let's get ready. All right, all you need you need two clips. Hold on, let me get off of this. Grab whatever two clips. I'm just gonna grab this wild WoW footage, this World of Warcraft footage. And what do you do? You overly just put the two clips. Right now they're overlapping, but we're gonna fix that. What you do? You double click on your first clip. Hold on. Uh, double click on the clip you wanna modify first. Uh, scoop this over. Go to Effect Controls, and then we're gonna go to Motion. Bring down the motion, and my my uh my project settings are at uh let's check it out the sequence settings. You see this? This right here is 1280 by 720p by 720, and that will be considered 720p high definition 720p. Okay, and these are the settings for split screen in 720p. Ready? We'll do uncheck uniform scale and I know the exact numbers for the, the height and the width but what you do is you just play with it like you squish it down do whatever you like scaling the height and the width until you get a perfect fit I, like right what I'm doing right now it's called scrubbing see this that's scrubbing I'm going back and forth you can't really see because my mouse isn't being recorded, but I'm going back and forth. You can tell by the numbers. The small to large. But I know the exact numbers. I play with it. You can either you can scrub like like so. And you can figure it out. Or you can just type it in. If you know the exact amount that it needs to be at, uh you can type it in. And for seven twenty P the height for split screen it should be sixty seven. And the width should be 33.5 now let me tell you it's not perfect this the scale for the 720 piece split screen that I just told you it's not perfect but it's as close to perfect as you're gonna get you a little bit of the the second one is gonna be split off and to save some time this is what you can do if you're using these these numbers right here you can right click right click on the clip you modified and go to copy and click on your second video clip and go to paste attributes and what you do is you grab the position you see position right here you go under that this video effects under the second clip's video effects and you take it you take it to the right see that perfect now let's check it out 
split screen split screen mode made easy and really the, this is just the basics the groundwork the infrastructure which which you build upon so hopefully you can use utilize this split screen on your video making endeavors but if not thank you for watching throw me a like subscribe comment show me your work I'd love to see what you you used it for hey thanks a lot and have a happy YouTube day take care